30-year-old Jessica Edwards was reported missing on Monday. Her phone is off and her car is still parked at her house. Tonight, her sister, desperate for answers. I just want my sister back. Right now, all I want is my sister back. So please help us look for her. Police now asking for help and any trace of information that could help them track Jessica down. Fox 61's Gabby Molina in South Windsor tonight. Gabby, what have you learned? Ben and Jen, I spoke to Jessica Edwards' family tonight, and they tell me that it's very unlike her to leave without telling anyone. They said they're very concerned about her safety, and they're asking for anyone with any information to come forward. I'm broken without her. I'm broken without her. 30-year-old Jessica Edwards of South Windsor was last seen by her sister late Sunday evening, Mother's Day, which she spent with her seven-month-old son, who her family says she would never leave. I want her son to be able to be held by his mom again. Police say Edwards' husband said he last saw her at 7 o'clock the next morning, leaving with an unknown person. She was reported missing that day. Her car was found at home and her phone is off. Police now trying to find out where she could be. See if we can get some more information on where she might be or where she might have gone. Because as far as physical addresses other than her area, we don't have much to go on. Her family doing what they can to bring their loved one home. Searching the area off of Pleasant Valley Road Thursday evening and putting up missing person posters. This is one of the many posters they put up around the Cinnamon Springs condo complex where Jessica lives. Neighbors say that police have had a presence here all week long. Detectives from canines to police officers have been around here, you know, day in, day night. They've been sniffing around from here and across the way to the other condominiums there. Both police and Edward's family trying to find answers. I just know that she's not home. I know that she's not here with us right now, so she needs to be found. That's all I know. That's all I know, that she needs to come home. South Windsor police say they have not ruled out foul play and are exploring every possibility, saying they just want her home safe. And to Jessica, if you're watching, please contact us and let us know you're okay. The Edwards family says that they're going to be planning searches tomorrow throughout different surrounding towns. They're going to be starting at the Riverfront Boathouse in Hartford at 10 a.m. Live in South Windsor, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.